Hello, all of my gorgeous angels and devils. Today I am playing Discourse. So, let's first play. Passport. She's a barista and an artist. She enjoys earplugs. Okay. Oh no, our plane crashed. My brain feels like it went through a coffee grinder. That's not good. It feels like I've been lying out here for hours. What is all this crap on the beach? Wait, a plane crash? But I was... Oh no. Alright, stay calm, Rita. Let's look. Yesh. Yeesh. Yesh. Yeesh. Good thing I wasn't in that seat. Oh, look at her. <laughs> what the heck was a frying pan doing on a plane? They're closing in on us. Huh? What the heck was that? That's my C. Good old 21C. I wonder if things would have gone differently if I was in a window seat. Let's go over here, can we? I should go check out that noise. Her legs are like all tied up. Let's go investigate. Another crabs! They're calling for backup! We're totally surrounded. Make sure you aim for their eyes! It will scramble the chips in their brains! It doesn't even matter, we're done for. <laughs> I got that frying pan I could smack on. Steve, somebody else is approaching! She's probably here to feast on us just like these crabs. What? Are you talking about me? You're totally clueless, aren't you, Teddy? Hey, lady! Now might be a good time to help us. Alright, I'm coming. I've got my trusty metal detector on me, but they will definitely attack if I pull it out. Just get over here and help me. What? No, come here! Well, I might as well try to put this frying pan to good use. Oh wait, they're just getting angrier. Oh no! Well, it sure got them to stop attacking me. Ouch, man, those crabs are relentless! My legs are all torn up. This has just been a fantastic day. Okay, well let's get back to camp. The others will want to meet. Um, I didn't catch your name? It's Rita. Wait, there are other survivors? Yeah, farther inland. I'm Steve, by the way. My name is Teddy. Alright, let's get going. Are you ready to head to camp? Yeah, let's go. Sure. Don't you think it's a little risky to get take this stranger back? Well, if she's just a bunch of crabs in a human suit. You were on an only child, weren't you, Teddy? No, my brother was human. I think we'll be fine. Let's go, Rita. They all look like so sad and stuff. I guess if I was on a stranded island, I would be too. I wouldn't look the greatest. Look, another survivor! What? I thought we were the only ones. Heavens to Betsy, come to have a seat. That looks like an owl. <laughs> you must have been out for hours. Are you all right? I think so. That's good. None of us seem to have been injured in the crash. What's your name? Rita. I'm Jolene. The lump over there with the mustache, that's my husband, George. Hi. Online, I'm known as <laughs> Nebulord90, but you can call me Garrett. All he's been doing is playing games on a stupid handheld video machine. Hey! Where are we? None of us are really sure. All we know is we're on an island. This island is pretty big. We have no clue what kind of stuff could be on the other side. There's a mountain off in the distance, but it's a long hike away. We have no idea what's over there. We've started making the best of this here situation. I got this fire built, and we got started on some shelter. So far, all we've got for food is a pile of pretzels from them off from off of the plane. Uh-oh, not anymore. That hog just took them. Cheese Louise and sweet cream cheese. <laughs> Oh no, those pretzels are our only food! Oh darn, those are going to be such a well-balanced meal for us. What if there are more of those, those pig monsters out there? Rita, you come with George and me. Let's get this boar. Mm, I don't think that's the best idea. It's not like we have weapons to hunt them. My Georgie has his old fishing pole. We can flop him with that. 
And I suppose you're going to throw that bulky camera off yours at them? Of yours at them? Well, I'll do what needs to be done. We need to stay here and defend the few resources that we've got left. Come along, Georgie. We don't have time for this, and I don't trust these hoodlums. Rita, you ready? Let's go. Let's get it. It's bacon making time. Oh, yeah. Yeehaw! That a girl. <laughs> Wait, hold on a second. You're just going to leave the three of us alone? Don't worry, you'll be fine. Don't worry, Garrett. You still have half the group left. You guys will be fine. What are we supposed to do if something attacks us here? Uh, y'all are as brave as a bar of soap. Defend the camp at all times. If you work, if you all work together, you'll have no problem defending the camp. Yeah, all right. Like it's that easy. No, without a healer in our not without a healer in our party. I'm sure you'll manage. We'll be back before you know it anyway. George and Rita, let's get moving. This is a lot of talking. Oh my there it is! We need to be careful or it will run away again. Maybe I can stun it with my camera flash. I've got my trusty fishing pole. Too bad it broke in the crash. I might be able to hit him with it. Alright, so what's the plan? Hang on, I'm thinking. Um, throw frying pan. I'm going to throw my frying pan at it. Are you sure that's a good idea? Can you really throw it this far? Uh, I think I can do it. Don't worry about it, Jolene. I got this. What? Whoa. I missed. Damn it. What was that? Did you really think you were going to hit that boar from the from here with the frying pan? It was like so close. I guess I'm just not as strong as I thought. Whoops. It's getting late. I think the hunt is a lost cause at this point. Let's just get ourselves back to camp. Maybe the others have better news. Darn it. I better get my frying pan. Oh, lesson learned. Darn, not a trace of him. These boars are sure fast. What is this? Huh? A clipboard? That's unusual. Hey, this paperwork is labeled Dicest Air. This must be from the plane. What is it, Rita? It's a maintenance checklist for the plane. But nothing's checked off. A spare copy, maybe? No, wait. There's a date on this. Our plane has hadn't been inspected since. 1991? What? There's no way that's legal. No, definitely not. I mean, I could be misinterpreting this or something, but still. I think I'll hang on to this paper. If we ever do get off this island alive, I certainly want some answers about this. Well, I guess it's time to go back. Let's jet, honey. Yeah, let's go. Whatever, let's just get out of here. Finally, you guys shouldn't have left us. What happened here? Um, yeah. There was definitely more than just that one boar. Oh, y'all are just belly aching. What even happened? More boars showed up. We needed everyone here. You shouldn't have listened to Jolene. We needed to stay together, Rita. It's like they have a hive mind. It was all part of a bigger plan. The first boar was just a distraction so the others could feast upon our flesh. We... We tried, to defend the, we tried to defend the camp like you said, and Garrett got slashed up pretty badly. You told us to do this, Rita. We could have all been killed. I maybe could have done more in my, if my legs weren't all cut up from those crabs. What did you want me to do? Swing Teddy around my head and beat the boars away? Plus, it doesn't look like you guys have brought anything back. It's my fault. I'm sorry, everyone. We lost the board because of me. Okay, it doesn't matter whose fault it was. You've all failed. Let's just get some rest. Look, let's just leave this be. Tonight we'll focus on resting and preparing for tomorrow. I guess we don't have much of a choice, do we? This isn't good. This is not good at all. We need to protect these pretzels. We shouldn't have... We shouldn't just leave them out in the open. There, that should help. Anyway, we set up a bit of shelter earlier this morning. Early this morning. Grab a torch and we'll show you the shelter we've made. Ooh, 
that's cool. And it'll catch on fire. <laughs> wow, you guys actually put together a pretty decent shelter, all things considered. I guess this is our home for now until we get rescued. This torch won't last forever, but I should have enough time to talk to a few people. I bet you've never been on an adventure like this before. Virtual reality is pretty advanced these days, though it doesn't hold a torch to the pa to these past hours. We're not going to die. That's not going to happen. Somebody will be along to rescue us. Hell yeah. Normally, boars are one of the easiest enemies in games. Oh my gosh! It's like actually a first level warrior! Yeah, I bet it was intense when they invaded. This adventure is hard, that's for sure. Well. Time to regenerate my hit points. Good night! This is going to be like the time George and I went camping on the beaches in South America. Why don't you and George sleep next to each other? Oh, what an odd question to ask. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have. No, it's okay, dear. He has this awful snoring habit. I can't sleep near him. Oh, I see. Why don't you leave the hunting to us country folk? Or you, and you stick to whatever it is you city folk do. I was just trying to help Jolene. Next time, why don't you keep your help to yourself? What? No! Finding you on the beach was a surprise. We were pretty lucky you were there, I guess. Yeah, that was oddly disorienting to wake up to. Yeah, you may have been better off without this group. We don't bring a whole lot to the table. I disagree. I think we make a pretty decent team. <laughs> team, you sound like my boss. Well, let's get some rest. The torch is too low. It's time for me to go to sleep. It doesn't look very comfortable, but I guess we'll have to serve for the night. Might as well try and get some shut eye. I'm by the snoring man. Oh no. Am I even gonna be able to sleep? Day two! Huh? Looks like we actually made it through the first night alive! I'm ready to get some things done today. I don't think you should be doing anything today. What? What do you mean? All you did yesterday was make things more difficult by leaving. Well, I'm gonna help y'all. You need- You might need me. Alright guys, I think I just need some coffee. Caffeine withdrawal makes me feel like I'm in college again. I'm going to check the wreckage for supplies. Maybe my string of bad luck will end. Who knows, there may be some water from the plane as well. We need to signal for help if we ever plan on being saved. Let's- If we don't find water that we can drink, we won't last very long. Well, why don't you see if there's a lake or something? On a desert island? Then Boar's gotta be drinking something. Why don't you take Garrett with you, Rita? He seems like he could use an adventure. What? I, uh... Alright, you ready to go, Garrett? I, um, I guess? I'll come with you as well. I'm no stranger to dealing with animals. Alright, sounds good to me. We're never going to get off of this island. This is ridiculous! I'll just stay back and watch the camp then. Well, I am going to stop here. I know it was a lot of talking. Jeez, I wasn't expecting that when I got this game. <laughs> but if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you aren't already. I'll talk to you all later. Bye! Everything. Okay. Oh yeah! Press the bar, say spore. Put an item by selecting it from the inventory. Okay, be quiet. Armor. Place food items in slot. Well, I don't have any 